Pair you up. What's going on, guys? Fire up your six six here, and we're here with another puzzle game. So this is based off Ken, 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 Ken. Um, and this is not easy. I'm just showing you this here. Four by four. All right. So this is obviously gotta be a four down here. But let me go ahead and show you guys what the rooms are. So I have to be filled with numbers, all of them have to be filled with numbers. One to four, obviously. And um, it's just like Sudoku where they can't, there can't be the same number in the column or the same row. Um, yeah. But what I didn't realize is see this 16 here? The same number can be in the same cage, they call it. So the cage is for 16, is these three right here. So a 4 could be here and a 4 could be there. It doesn't violate the rule of the row or the column, so it's possible. I didn't actually know that. So this makes it a lot more difficult. And the thing is, you, they're just random order of where you put them, basically. You won't, you know what they are, what ones go in here, but you don't know, say, is this a four, or is this a, or just, well, with this, it'd be easy, because these two have to be fours. Or it could be this a two, and this a two, and this is a... Four. So this one's probably better to explain. So this could be a three, one, one, three, or even a six, two, two, six. You. This gets hard. Let's just say that. So see, four, four, one, four, one, three, one. See how they're all same? Right there. Don't violate the rule. And I can make notes. I didn't know that. Oh yeah, I can make note. Okay. Simple enough. So we know a four has to be there. Um this could be a four. This obviously has to be a four. Or one. And this either has to be a four or one. Or one and four. So this is where it gets fun. Thirty-six. So it could be three two three two, or it could be three three four one, two three two three even. There's just a ton of different combinations it could be. This one a little bit easier. Well, this one's easy. It's gotta be two or one. And one and two. So tips is to just go with the smaller numbers first. Break that down, and then work on the bit. Uh, just go from the smallest to the biggest. Unless you see uh, one thing like this one that says four, so four obviously has to be in there. Um. This could be a host of different things. It could be any of these, actually. A 4 times 3 times 1 is 12. 3 times 2 times 2 is 12. So 
this is where I don't really like it, where you actually have to go off assumptions, basically. You have to guess. Which I don't like so much because if you're wrong, it messes you up so much and you have to go back and redo it, basically. And I'm just doing this in my, in my head. So... Oh, I don't know if you could do that. Okay. So basically, um, I have to think this for just in my head, and uh, there's no there's no pen and paper in here. <laughs> um, so yeah, not fun. So thirty six. Again, it could be any of them. So it's obvious that the well, all of them have to be here somewhere. So this could either be four, one, two, three. So the one, oops. So this can only be one, two, or three. Same here. Well, we know that these can't be one or two. Because the one and two are down here. And we know the four can't be here. So that makes the four right there. So that makes that four go away, that four go away, and this four is it. So that four goes away as well. Wait a minute. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. there's not a 4 here? Is it possible? It is. Wait, is it? Yeah. 2, 2, 2, and 3. So since the 4 is gone, No, that's not possible though. See, see what I mean by these? They just don't make sense. So the four theoretically should be here, but that cancels that out. These can't be it, that one, so it has to be this one, but then these just cancel out. Oh, I just realized that this is three and two. So there's no one here. There's no one in any of these. It's just three and two. Now the problem is, is the three here or two here? Once we know what this one is, we know what this one is and these two. So. Just have to figure that out. And now, this one, if you look at it, the only way the two works is if these two multiply together went to six, which is not possible right now. So these combinations 
this is the one and the four or three go right here so that makes the four go right there the one go right there And the three has to go here, because if you look at it, if the three went here, none of these would work. Because the three has to be here or here. So then the four is right there. So then the three would be here, three would be there, two would be there, two would be there. One, two, three, four. That works. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Yep. One, two, three, four. Perfect. So then a four works here. The three does not work here. Or here. So the three is right there. The two is right here. Then the one's right there, two's right there, and the one's right there. Let's go. Oh, I never want to do that again. And as normal, these things are broke. Alright, I'll be right back. Okay, well, um, you know the jigsaw puzzle that I did? I actually can't get back on that. Because the game... The videos don't work, basically. So, they... It automatically puts me into a video. But the video won't play. And I can't do anything about it. So, I found another jigsaw puzzle game that works. Let's do another one of these, I guess. A lot is involved with this. And this could be anything. And so can this be anything. 32 again. I'm pretty sure like we, like we had before. Yeah, it could be anything. That doesn't mean that it is everything, though. Because 12 times 2 is just 24. So 1 times 2, 2, 3 times 4, 12. That does not equal 32. And the three here. Can it be a three? I actually don't think it is a three. And do you think that that's three times what is going to get, get it up to 32 and then times something else? Nothing. I think one is a viable option. Mostly because this could be four, 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 two, one. Is that the only way, actually? Yeah, that's the only way. So, four, four, two, and one is somewhere here. And then this could be anything. This could be anything. This is obviously a one. So this could be anything besides a 1. Which means this could be anything besides a 1 or a 2. Wait. It can't be a 2, actually. Yeah. It just can't be a 1. Because it could be still a 3 and a 2. But 2 and 1 doesn't work.
Yeah, that's all on the table still. That one could be right there. And the only way this works is if it is one, two, three, no fours. Having notes is a lot easier now. So obviously the four and one can't be here. Oops. So it's obviously a two or three. We don't know if the three's here or two's here. Um the ones can't be here. So they gotta be up there somewhere. And now we're stuck. Um, yeah, we're just stuck now. Um, oh wait, three, if you look at this, there's no three here and there's only the option for three there. So that would make this a two. Two can't be there. Or there. Or there. So then the one and four are up here, obviously. Thing is, we don't know which one. And we can't cancel out the one or four here because um, the four could be here, which means the four could be here as well. And the or the one could be here, which means the one could be there. So the one would have to be here because the four and three have to be here because three minus one is two, not one, and four minus one is three, not one. So the one's out of there. We can't have more than one, one, or yeah, more than one, one here. And then this has to be a two because 2 times 4 times 4 is the only way this equals 32. And the 4s and 4s can't be together. They That would just violate the number second rule. The second rule. So there's the 4 and then there's another 4. So this makes it 3. This one make it a four, and this one make it a one. So the four is out there. The one is out of here. Four it can't be here, or the three. So the two has to be here, and the three has to be there. That would make that a two. That would be the one. Then this would be the three and four. All right. Yeah, that's what happens with my upper game. So once I click off this and then go back in it, it might work. It worked last time, so maybe I have to click off. So, um, we'll do one more game. I'll see you guys in a second. Right back on. So I'm going over these ones. Oh, this one's easy. Oops. <laughs> it's not as easy as I make a mistake. All right. Three here. Can't be multiple fours. Can't be multiple threes. 
or two, so it's got to be two, three, and four. The one is just too low for it. Yeah, the one is way too low for that. Oh, the four has to be here. So then the two and three are competing down there. This one, let's think about this for a second. It's in three, so it can't be multiple of the same number. So four, two, two doesn't work. The only one that works is four, three, and one. One and three. Oh, whoops, that's a three actually. So this obviously can't be a three or here. So the two goes here. Okay, I'm clicking too fast. So then this is either this is the four actually, and that's the three. So twelve times two is twenty-four. So we got it there. This is the two, and this is the three. This is the one, and this is the four. So 12 with one in it. Okay, so this has got to be a two. This is the one, this is the three, and that's the two. Two minutes, 40 seconds. Let's go. Alright guys, so I hope you enjoyed. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I'll see you guys later. See ya.